and Friday, December the 22nd, I was promoted to the general class for the first time. The room was filled to the brim and there were more participants in the doorway and the courtyard. By my estimation, there were roughly 150 of us. Networker Ajala from Ikiti State, a middle-aged man with a protruding belly and a distinct Iluoke accent, was addressing the audience when I stepped in at about 9.30 a.m. Thank you, our Father. Thank you, our Father. He encouraged the audience to maximize their Burkina Faso stay by laboring hard for themselves, their loved ones, and the people whose destinies are attached to theirs. Next week again, there is January 2. I go receive money where I go praise Kufis and the money. Ah, it's quite some business. That dollar sweet. So please and please, if you are not there yourself, hope. But because of those destiny, because of that impact that you're supposed to make. He had his listeners where he wanted them by occasionally adding, May God help us in Jesus' name, to which they heartily responded. Amen. At other times, he punctuated his exhortation with a sequa as a business, to which the audience chanted Alonso. Husband and responsible father. Likewise, your purpose of assistance, your purpose of coming to Burkina Faso, is for you to make enemies for your immediate family, so that they may see you as a responsible husband and responsible father. Our mothers, the Lord will help us in Jesus' name. Amen. Once he even told them, you are here in Burkina Faso to learn how to shout hallelujah forever because hallelujah is a unique language. Any part of the world, because it's not language from this side, go to French, go to Portugal, go to any, any language, hallelujah is hallelujah. Because they didn't write it, and they may not write it the way they write it, but their pronunciation is the same. You are here to learn how you will shout it. He ended his talk with a lengthy prayer session during which he willed the destructive fire of God upon witches and wizards or powers in your father's house or mother's house gathered against your upliftment and prosperity. Any power that want to stagnate you, any power that says you will go but not go far, the fire of God will destroy them in the name of Jesus. Yeah. I don't want to know. Maybe that power is your father's house, your mother's house, or from your in-laws house. But I stand on the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and the mother and that power. I declare anything at all that they want to use in order to stagnate your life. Be roasted by fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every book can go up against your life. Bible say gather, they will gather together. But if they are gathered not the Lord, they will scatter. Anywhere they gather against your upliftment, anywhere they gather against your prosperity, anywhere they gather against your divine upliftment, let the fire of God make them desolate in the name of Jesus. Amen.